Hi everyone, Siege back here with another Monster Train Penumbra video. It's the weekend at my place and it's time to do some extra recordings. I've been able to consistently do some recordings um, this current week and I'm able to do three at a day. However, let's see what we can whip up today. Um, it's pretty cold right now in our place. It's already the rainy season. So let's hope that that rainy season does not affect our gameplay today as it's a bit really cold at my location right now. Hopefully our brain is hot enough to think about the correct actions and plays into our run today which is going to be Default Umbra and Exile Awoken. So we have Root Seeds and Shade Splitters today. Currently in a 16 winning streak, we are 6 out of 6 for Penumbra. We only have 4 more to go and one of them is Exile Awoken. Let's jump right in. So for that, leave a like or a dislike guys if you enjoy this content. Subscribe to the channel for more so that you don't miss out as well on my regular uploads. And let's get on with another awesome Penumbra run. Okay, so again, Default Umbra, Exile Awoken, with Antumbra Assault, Sting, and Gravel. Good that we have all spells because we have Diligent as our boss. Also, Explosive Sigil Daedalus and Rage Fell. So a lot of enemies here. Um, Fell is particularly, I think, a little bit dangerous here, so we need to address her. I don't think we have diligent problems so much here. So let's see what kind of setup we need to do today to secure our 17th victory. We have a double horde start here. That's something I'd like to see. We do have backline access with the, with the help of the Antumbra Assault. So we have that going for us. Temples today at are at 4, 5, 6, 7, and 8. Okay. All late game temples. So I think I can hold out on taking ring 4. We could go ahead and take double horde here and money if we can. And hold out for ring 5 for our infusion. Ring 8, steel shop vortex, magic shop dupe. Fair. Ring 7, steel shop Cave. Removal dupe health opposite that. Very good. We like to make sure that we can take advantage of this towards the late game. Double shop on ring 6. Magic shop is better with cave and horde. Steel shop is decent with money and some health. Ring 5, trinket shop money health. There is money on the trinket shop so I probably can look for some relics. Don't not really sure what I'm trying to look for though. Not in particularly anything right now. The magic shop here though is very powerful. That's Vortex Caves. It's back-to-back -back magic shops here guys. So we have to make sure or try our best to make sure our unit is fully upgraded by Ring 4. So that I can take advantage of Ring 5, 6 magic shop. Yeah, that's the play. Steel shops on the late game are decent as well. So let's look at our early game here. Ring 4, Magic Shop Awoken Money, Steel Shop Health Vortex. Both good sides here. However, Awoken Banner is the only banner on Ring 4. You have an Umbra Banner with a dupe on Ring 3. That's maybe our infusion opposite a Horde and some random health. Ring 2, Steel Shop, Umbra Banner, Merchant of Magic, Awoken Banner. We don't... I like this Magic Shop simply because Root Seeds and Awoken. We could maybe find a Sweeper. And play from that angle. Maybe we see Perils somewhere here. Yeah, we can work with this. I think we can. Let's check our... First horde. It's Sinner Salve. 
Um, that can play well into Diligent. They also have First Help Pack. If I see Mind Collapse or Shroud Spike, it could be good. I also have Awoken. So I think um, taking the First Help Pack here is the correct action. There are a lot of good hits, especially in Umbra. They are, I guess, the Master of X cost card. So let's take that for value. The Horde here, I'm not sure I want to take it. You don't have too much damage outside buffs. No hard-hitting spells. Forge today is Architect and Monstrous. I think we go Architect here. Very good unit. Do I take the Horde? Can I muscle through that? Yes, I guess I can. Go to 25, maybe take 40, delay the infusion, move here. I think I'll take it. Ooh, Hell's Banners, that's good. With Morsels, can reasonably manage this. Morsel Gen would allow me to play out Root Seeds a lot more. Let's take that for Ember. It also might play into the X cost cards, giving us maybe good spikes and... That's gonna be good. Okay, this is an armor trial. This is concerning for the reason that, again, we don't have too much backline access. If I give armor to this, I basically prevent myself from killing the foot soldiers. And I don't think we can handle that. Hmm. Let's turn this off. As much as I want to take the unit draft, I think we... Hmm. Damage, shield, stinks. I think I can muscle through. I think we can. I want that unit trial. That's, I, that's the reason I'm taking this. Let's split this guy up for more morsels there you go okay we need to get our unit up to a certain level that he kills units i want morsel need to go over 50. morsel morsel okay let's eat all the morsels we can. 6, 34, 40, 46. So, if I play the train steward here, I get him down to 40, which secures me the kill. Yeah, that's good. So, the play now is to look for units in the back that can deal damage. Um, I only had this is 20 HP I have to get through. I don't think I can manage that. Let's prepare. So, we'll, we'll take 5 here for sure. I need to have a train steward in the back that can hit for 11. Yes. So, I think I morsel in front. Take extinguish and... Oh no, I don't take the extinguish trigger. Train Steward in the back. I buff this guy up. So I draw faster. And then we sting here. Okay. Take five. That guy is concerning. But we can hopefully address him. I need to root seeds at least once. Secure this foot soldier kill. I sting bottom floor to get rid of the 
armor that he has. I need to play morsels to trigger Hell's Banners here. Um, I need to save the damage shield here. I can play morsel in front. This does not change. I play the morsel middle. Generate me ember. Play shade splitter. Maybe it's damage. It is not. And then we work on giving root seeds in the back. Good. Carefully navigating this is important. Um, six is not enough to snipe the back. I might be able to... Six. If I draw into both of these, I might be able to kill him. Yes. Let's bring out the armor. Let's generate morsels. Okay, two morsels here. Um, I'm not getting new morsels, so I should play these two on top. Root seeds here and try to ping out the back unit. Okay. Okay, we win. <laughs> yeah, I, I did get to snipe that guy right there. I chomp block with you. Get you in. Play another one. And we win. Perfectly navigated. Love it. Okay, we do see apparels. I think we click the peril so that the magic shop visit is good. I don't think I'm going to that steel shop. Because I can visit this steel shop right here. Yeah, take the perils of production. Ooh, some scaling. I like that. Um, Wildwood sap is also here. I think we pick up the razor sharp edge. That's a form of scaling and the ping as well. Mm hmm. We're given an alloy construct here. Is that something we want to lean in on? Maybe. Because if I visit the Umbra banner, I might see another alloy construct and maybe I can make that my line. That's possible. We have I have more soul gen in gravel. Um Yeah, I can take that. I can make that work. I could self-infuse that here. Or even get it from the banner. I don't think I'm visiting this side here. So let's go right side here. Magic shop. Remove consume. No. Plus 10. Okay, let's try to compute the money. Um, I get one... I spend 50 gold, I go down to 100. I re-roll. If I see something good, I get the money. Let's check the unit first though. That's a good unit. Animus of Will is a decent unit here. Let's take it. We check, get the plus 10, make the Antombrasol a little more reliable. Minus 1 should go on a root seed. Root seeds. Maybe it should, should be singular. It's only one root seed there. They put that on razor sharp though. Play that whenever we can. No. Our Animus of Will is currently... Currently has how much HP? 3. We can only play it once. So let's spin this. I see a Permafrost. 20 consume? I don't think so. I'm grabbing that other minus 1 into another root seed. No? Hold over. Pretty sad about that. So 
In this scenario, we don't take the money. There are no shops in middle floor. But I think we visit this side right here. We go right coming up. So we leave the money right there. Don't touch it. You don't need it. Um, We can manage this unit draft. And the spikes. Oh no. Did I just... No, no. We did not misclick. Okay. Okay. I got scared there for a bit. Sorry about that. Um, we probably would draw into something here. Let's play this. Play Morsel. Penumbra. Alloyed. Jeweler. Chill. Okay. I don't have a ping to get my foot soldier. Concerning. I'm swinging for two. So, 31. This is 30. So I kill it. Let's buff. Let's kill. And then, I guess I chomp block train steward here. The animus will will die. Um, I guess I get this unit killed. I don't play the animus. Good. A lot of root seeds here. I see my Antumbra assault. I'm definitely clicking that. There you go. I want... Uh, what do I want here? I'm gonna feed morsels here for sure. Let's root seeds. Okay, let's put train steward one. Morsel two. Crack open the gravel. Put Antumbra in the front. Then feed this bottom guy morsels for being there. And then what do we do here? Um, a lot of things. I could buff him up and then chomp block in a way. I'll probably draw into something eventually. Address those in bottom. I think I razor sharp here. Let's crack shade splitter. That's one. That's two. I chomp block with this. And then another one. I want to preserve the damage shields we have. Let's perils. I should have perils bottom floor. It's a mistake. Yeah, that was a mistake. I could have done like, maybe killed this tank here. Maybe I could just sting it out. Yeah, sting it out. Definitely. No. Yeah, I think the best play here. Let's sting into Antumbra so Give us a little more morsel. And then we root seeds, play another morsel. Chomp block, we win. I think we have enough HP here to survive. Root seeds, gravel, razor sharp, chomp block in front. We're good. Okay. It may be an alloyed construct line here. That we have to assemble. I like the prismal dust. There's your payout for first hell pack. Snap that in. I like the steel enhancer to offset razor sharp. Although glimmer is here. It's a good plus 30 target. Maybe I should pick that up. Hmm. I can get HP from Morsels, I guess. He is good, though. That's a very good... Ooh. I like what I see here. Don't have heals. I don't think that's the Hermit. I think I can make the Morsel made work. 
gives HP and then all the morsels I feed it get eaten automatically. I don't have to protect the morsels. And even though, hmm, problem is the infusion of alloyed construct is Hmm. How do I feel about the morsel made? What if I put the alloyed construct into morsel made instead? Um, that's gonna give me multi strike and inert. Good question here. Is self infuse? Is Morsel made better as an infusion? Get HP. Um, I'm looking for quick. Do I snap the Morsel made? I don't have insane Morsel gen to, to make Morsel made my base unit. So it's not Animus of Will as well. Maybe what I can do is infuse the morsel, infuse the animus of will into morsel made. I'll pack morsels here. This would be good. Hmm. How do I solve eating on Divinity? I need to find a way to feed him morsels, is the thing. I have to think about this a, a little bit more. Morsel made. He scales with eating. How much morsel gen do I have? I have shade splitters. And root seeds to speed my draw up. I could hold over the gravel. I think it depends on what I see coming up. I think I take it for now. Let's open up our options. Now, I think I could try to high roll into fossilized fangs, but I think that's throwing if I go left. We go right here for sure. Yes. Um, I check the caverns first. No, I check the Umbra banner first. I don't think these are the take. No, we skip. Those those are not the take here. I think. The horde is acceptable here. Emblem of the Exiles is survivability on my alloyed construct. Speed. I can protect my... No, I think it's alloyed construct here with Emblem of the Exiles. I think that's going to be my play. I do alloyed construct. Remove the extra units here. Ah, this is hard. Okay, what do I do with that hell vent? Do I have enough money to buy stuff here? Not really. Maybe I should visit the magic shop then. I think the steel shop is important though. I'll get money from the next combat. Okay, let's think about this again. Um, Animus of Will with Morsel Made. Can I feed him enough morsels to scale? He's gonna offset the razor sharp if I put the... Animus of Will in to Morsel Made. 
I could dupe the gravel to increase the density of morsel gen. Maybe scale faster with that, protect it with prismal dust. And then I don't have the feeding the morsel problem. Take 10 in piercing and antombra salt. Ensure that I get morsels out of these. And I already have multi strike. I could go for quick, quick multi for triple hits. But then, how am I? They both have the same problem if you only want one unit on the floor. Can't play double alloyed constructs. So, yeah. Uh, the, bet, the good thing about Morsel made is it plays well into Razor Sharp. Yes. So. Let's check the caverns first. Yes. Let's check the caverns first. Um. Hmm. I don't think I take the Strength Stone here. Unfortunately. I think. I take the Bone Rattler. Yeah, let's take the Bone Rattler. It's free damage for the Pyre. The dupe here is going to be just a second copy of Gravel. Increase Morsel Generation. Move on. Okay. Now, the question is, who do I use in this combat? Hmm, good question. I don't know the answer. I guess since I saw him first, I'm gonna use him. So let's do that. Let's play Magma, Penumbra, Morsel Maid. Morsel, he eats everything. And then I start scaling. Okay, good. I don't play Alloyed here. I chump block with Train Steward. Get another one killed. Maybe I do this. Maybe I get to play some morsels into him. Maybe. A big maybe. Um, let's ping. Let's generate more morsels okay one morsel two morsel let's play um animus of will no i think i just drop big bone rattler finding vapor funnel somewhere in this run would be a good thing to find <laughs> Okay, okay, we get the kill. That's good. The good thing about Gravel is it triggers Hell's Banners by itself. It's just a thing we want. 68. There you go. We're over the threshold, I will... I guess hold on to the Prismal Dust for now. Wait for the draw through to play it out. I need to kill the unit in the back. Need to buff Penumbra then. I take two, I guess. Can chump lock here. Another one, another one. It's gonna be a slow run because of how often we can pop things i think i glimmer middle okay take two that's fine or take three because of explosive sigil grovel here just take seven damage shield here i guess Okay, we betrayed the alloyed construct. It's not his day today. Okay, more morsels, please. Yeah, I think this scales fast enough. 
put you here. Okay. And then just eat a little more. Kill that. It's a bit slow, guys. I apologize. This is the madness of playing Morsel Maid. There you go. Powerful. Ooh, okay. It's Shroud Spike, guys. We have the ingredients. You see the second alloyed construct? It does. It was given to us, but here it's now a skip. Now, we don't need space. I don't think we need ember. Just draw more morsels then. So, we're gonna be sitting around fiddling our fingers to play a lot of morsels. We go steel shop here we are gonna be cutting units i take quick on my morsel made for sure remove alloyed and train steward definitely um i do the infusion right now because i want multi-strike on my unit he does go to zero, but he'll scale fast enough. The minus two. I want to remove consume on this card in a spell chain. So the minus two. I guess I put that on Gravel. Look for a holdover and that's going to be awesome. Um, Steel shop. Where am I going next string? Probably the magic shop. So save our money. And here. Just take architect too. It's going to be my free space relic on the floor. I can beat this guy. I just feed morsels. Yes. So. Why do I do this? Eh? Hmm. Take Ember Drain then. I guess I take Ember Drain. Morsel 1. Morsel 2. Razor Sharp. Sting. Morsel? Ooh, I get my collector. Nice. Morsel? Morsel? more so oh dear uh i want don't want the curse i guess i play the prismal dust no not yet i want to draw into it for a second time um hmm let's play more so wait more so I think root seeds. How much damage do I need? This is 140. Um, hmm. This is 150 altogether. Combined. Um, hmm. Rage. Thing. Curse. Okay, I leak one. <laughs> I I tried, guys. I tried. I tried to fit him in. Root seeds. Wait, 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 wait. I need... Oh, no. Oh, no. Can't ping out anything. I guess I shade splitter into shroud spike. Yes. Play you and then spike. <gasps> oh no. I can't do the spike play. Forgot about that. Okay. We're gonna take some hits. Oh 
Ugh, that hurts. That really hurts. More so. More so. Root seeds. More morsels. Chomp block? No. Double chain steward. Okay. Can I kill the next wave? Um, I have damage shield here. Um, let's root seeds, root seeds, damage shield. 71 by 71. Um, how do I play this one out? There you go. Taking another hit. Can I survive this? Wait. I need to do this. Split him up. Okay. I'm not sure if I can win. Can I... Um... Ah, I can't play Shroud Spike. That's annoying. Ooh, <laughs> just barely. Curse goes out. Ooh. Okay, we barely got out of that. You need to solve some problems in this build. Ah. <sighs> Um, more morsels or void binding? I guess I pick up a void binding here. Don't think they need feast. Um, yep. Divine artifact. Let's take the Wern Grindstone. We might need it. I am looking for Holdover. Thank you, game. Um, Now, where does the Holdover go? Perils? So I can play Void Binding. Protection? Yes. Wanted to put it on gravel, but I think spell chain holdover is the play here. Um, minus one on my root seeds. Spin. Permafrost on my what? I need intrinsic on that spell. I think. If I'm hoping to play that somewhat sometime soon, I think I need something to play into that. Temple, spell chain. Spell chain holdover. I mean sorry, spell chain perils. Or spell chain gravel. Might be spell chain gravel actually. That's gonna scale me a lot more the reason we take perils is to enable void binding yes i really want this if this was possible but the only way this happens is turn one maybe i find intrinsic and i can make it work but i think i want certain value and I think gravel provides that for us to put that into gravel we remove cards um I think they got our train stewards here yes they're not morsels so we cut them um permafrost 
is is hmm. Can I make the permafrost work on Shroud Spike? Hmm. I keep picking this card up and not utilizing it to its best potential most ri sometimes. Uh huh. Shroud Spike. Let's check the temple first. Build a card. Hmm. This can help the thing work. Um, armor. Buff. Ascend. Yes. Okay. So the way we make that work now. Is we freeze. We freeze Shroud Spike, so we have it on hand. And then as soon as we get a morsel, we push it up from middle floor and spike it. That's going to be the play. Now I feel more comfortable about the Shroud Spike. Spell Shield. This is... This might become a problem. I should turn this off because this prevents me from does it yeah it prevents me from killing units which means I can't eat morsels I do want the money though hmm can I make this work Uh, I think I take too much time. I won't be able to clear the floor. There are wide floors here. And putting spell shield prevents Antombra assaults from working. Yeah, we turn this off. We can't manage that. Whew. Scary. There's your shroud spike, I guess. Animus. Penumbra. Root Seeds. Bone Rattler. Okay. Collector. We have Burials as well. So let's kill Wide Floors. Kill this so that we can feed. So the goal is to keep the floor two units wide. I think I'm fine with three. Let's work on bottom floor here. Yeah, that, that guy is a problem. If we took Spell Shield Healer, we are going to be crying right now. So, let's chill. Let's kill this one. Wait, how many cards do I have on hand? Wait, I think I have too many. Four, eight, nine. Okay. Okay. More so. More so. Gravel. More so. More so. Um. Perils. Void binding. Gravel again. Root seeds. Yeah, I. This is the setup. You can't spike right now. Okay, but we can spike soon. There's the good spike. So, how do we work this? We say perils. We want to generate more cells here. Let's crack open gravel first. I want to... Spike this guy. So the way I do that is wait. If I don't glimmer here, I take a lot of damage. I only hit 
twice. So I think I have to glimmer. Definitely. Okay. Um let's one forty. Oh, I think I did that my mistake. Huh. How do I wanna fix this? Um, play a train steward to take hits in the back. Yes. Um, razor sharp. I need to kill this guy. Get me a morsel. Good. I think I don't gamble the other one. Okay. How do I solve this one? I have two units there that can't be killed. I need to scale this guy up to 140. Okay, I leak 246. I take 8. Yeah, I take 8. Okay, I need the glimmer here, definitely. Let's not skip that. Good. Careful. I need a morsel that I can spike for a shitload of damage. Let's gravel here first. Oh, there's a damage shield here. So... I play this one first. Play the free cards. I need to trigger... Health banners. Uh, push this guy up. And then spike him for 14 times. Okay, there you go. That's enough survivability to win. Ooh, that's a hard setup to do. Good. And we win. Need more morsels, I guess? Doesn't matter, I have enough hits on the floor. Thing, Tumbra, Morsel. Okay, we managed to get out of that combat. What we need right now is wave clear. Okay, good. Okay, trample as well. Something we want to see. Feast engine upgrade, prism retrieval. Can I use Risen Retrieval for anything? Not really. We skip. Yep, we skip. Awake. Invigorating. You know what? That Pyro Shards looks like something important. No. I'm thinking of it as a wave clear, but I don't think we want that. Okay. Question, magic shop? I already have holdover. I want an extra hit on my floor. Endless, no. Damage shield, no. Plus 25, no. We spin. Another quick. Bad shop. I <laughs> should have gone to the magic shop then. Intrinsic. Intrinsic perils. How about that one? Um, intrinsic perils allows me to scale as soon as possible. I think I do grab it. Uh, 
Oh, my clearing floors, though. Need extra hits. What's my dupe? Okay. Let's remove a card. Train steward. Hmm. Okay, do I pick up that intrinsic? Another spell chain. Could spell chain this. Or I could spell chain the shroud spec, but that shroud spec is hard to connect into. I think it's void binding here. Oh, I need trample somehow. Intrinsic. Okay, that's weird. I think we're good. We move on. Hmm, I think I should have gone there. There might have been a trample stone on that side. Two hits is not enough. Ah, need to do something about that shroud spike again. Perils, root seeds, this one, this one. Let's click things faster here. Okay. Perils. Play. Hmm. Let's do this here. Play morsels. Taking another 15. Ah. Need to solve our problems here. Ping you out. Hmm. Don't think I want to incant that guy. What happens if you get a second morsel made? Um, six damage shield. Want to remove consume. Perils, Gravel. I think the stats are here. Okay. Not the super spike that I really want here. Um, but I do want a lot of damage. Hmm. Super spike this. Okay. <sighs> How do I solve my current problem there is a problem we look strong but we have wave wave clear problems we're only hitting for two times on this floor we can get fell here we can kill him i need trample or some other way to clear waves okay yeah fell should implode here for sure Gravel. Hmm. 
Yeah, the damage shield is enough. The wave gear is again the big problem. Okay. And then, yeah, it's a surefire victory here. Get more cells to get Ember. I need to trample this damage out. Ah, oh, thank you. <laughs> There's the solution. It's right in our face. I need to draw more cards then. Okay, we've solved the problem. Ah. Hmm. Damage shield. Protect me, please. Okay, that was concerning, but we now have the solution. Now, do I need a dupe? Hmm. No. Let's go steel shop. Look for another multi strike. These are not the things that we want. Oh dear, the steel shops are so bad in this run. Plus 30. I think I put that on Glimmer. Okay, champion. Architect 3. Can play middle. I actually think we should be playing middle here on the Divinity. Uh, give me an Awoken Trail Spike. That Shroud Spike is hard to play. <laughs> we did hit on the, all the good X cost cards. Amazing run. But what would have happened if it did not hit Trample? How do you run Morsel Made without Trample? I think I'll experiment on this run. Take a second Morsel Made and see what happens if you play a second one in front. He can manage this. Whew. Okay. Now. How are we doing this? I have... Yeah, I can do this. This. We need to draw into our good spells. Okay. It's in camp. Okay, just feed this guy. Okay. Where's my spike? I see my spike. I ping you out. Hmm. Ping one of these out. We need our trample ASAP. Bone Rattler. Where's my trample? I'm literally gonna put intrinsic on that card as soon as I find it. Um, Void Binding. They take the curse hits here. Maybe I see a morsel. Yes, good. Take out the curses. Take two. Take three. Damn. Not very clean. Not a very clean run. Um. Oh, we're taking hits here. Here. Not scaling fast enough. Can I survive? I might be dead. <laughs> I have 1 HP, guys. I don't know what I'm gonna do with my life. Hmm, let's play the spike, I guess. No, if I take these curse hits, I'm dead. What am I gonna do with that guy? I'm dead. Okay, okay. Let's think about this a little harder. Whew. These floors are big. I need to address the curses as much as possible. I might even have to raise them up. I can chop block with Penumbra, right? 
can put him at the back. Hmm. I don't think it matters. Hmm. Push you up. I can kill you earlier. Hmm. Okay, let's think about this. Um, kill you. Hmm. I think I need to kill the curse. Okay, can get red one. Okay, concerning. Need to kill that guy. Curses are a problem. Okay, take five. Can't gamble that one. Ooh. Okay, we're not scaling as fast as I am expecting. Hmm, 105, 105. Trample does not get through. I draw 6. Glimmer is included. Um, draw 3. I think I can play 1 Ember here. I can play Gravel and get back the cost. Yes. Okay. I can draw 7. I only have 5. I spend 2. Then Spike. Morsel. Root Seeds. Glimmer. I think I glimmer here. Okay, two hit. Okay. This is the back line that I can't access. Take nine. Hmm. Okay, take another 9. Ugh. Okay, another big problem here. Oh fudge. I can't take another 9. Um, I'm dead again. Oh dear. We're gonna get killed by this curse combat. Whoo. Hmm. I think I maybe should have visited this shop right here. Magic. Helvent. Yeah, maybe I should have gone to the Helvent here to dupe the... Glimmer. I think so. Should have visited this shop as well. Hmm. Okay, how do we address this? The curses are slowing us down. 
This is too much damage to allow it to escape. Okay. How do I work this? Kill you. Okay. Take twelve. They see my trample here. I do this what happens here oh no made some bad mistakes I am not giving up though I think I did slim down my deck enough. What if I don't click perils? Yeah, what if I don't click perils here? Let's try that. Yeah, let's not click perils because that takes up one of our draws. Okay. Curse. No, that was a mistake. I think I will work with that mistake for now. <coughs> I think I'm missing out too much scaling without perils. Okay. I don't want to lose my streak. Yeah, that's too much damage to give up. Okay, good. Uh-huh. 
need to save HP as much as I can. Hmm. I'll kill you. I need the Shroud Spike to play into this. However, I'm not connecting on them. Hmm, this? Okay. Take 10, basically. Okay. Can we fix this? Ooh, I have... Ah, that's a very big unit in the back. Thing, thing, root seeds. Okay, sorry about that interruption, guys. Let's hopefully continue here. Uh. Okay, how do we push through here? Hmm. This shroud spike is dead. I have 19 HP now. Hmm. Okay. What if I spike now? Draw six. Can't put them on hand though. Hmm. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Maybe I glimmer the one in the bottom floor here. I let, let that nine walk. Draw cards. Okay, good. Okay, that changes our trajectory here. We may be able to get out. Cut the curses. 150. Glimmer here. Damage shield. Okay, we may be out. I think we may be out of this. That random spike just saved our run. Okay, get rid of that guy. He's scarily staring us down in the face. Two for one. Okay, good. Ooh, okay, we're clearing through things now. Oh dear. Scaling is slow. How do we solve this? I was on the verge of giving up, guys. Good thing I did not. This run could for surely be optimized. Hmm. Barrels, root seeds, root seeds thing. Double void. No. Misclick. I think we win. Yes, we win here. Okay, I need to address wave clear. Because this is not enough to win. Okay. 
It's hard to connect the shroud spike. Okay. We need to handle wide floors somehow. These are not solutions. I guess I could take fire shards, put it on myself. Nah. And graph is important. Don't think I can visit the steel shop anymore. Or do I need to visit the steel shop? I see multi strike. The only thing that improves is more soul made gets an extra hit. I think the merchant of magic is a lot better. Okay. I think it's magic shop time here. Yes. We need wave clear. That's the one we're missing. Remove consume on rail spike. I think is a big take here. It draws us through. Eat faster. We need ten in piercing, maybe? Remove Consume Awoken's Rail Spike is a good take. Mm, yes. Think at shop, what do you have to solve my problems? Cursed Vines, Mask of Penumbra draws me faster. Hmm. Okay, I think I definitely take the remove consume and awoken trail spike that's for sure one of the upgrades that we want we want an upgrade on abandoned and tumbra for more damage we want a minus one on void binding pin we have a holdover this holdover is important where does it need to go more scaling or hold over awoken's rail spike or glimmer i was referring to not having wave clear this is wave clear in a very good way um hmm temple has a minus two this is gonna draw like a second set of cards. X plus four. And then I hold over the glimmer. I need that for wave clear eventually. This is gonna make everything free so I play cards faster is the shroud spike important though there might be a big shroud spike play hidden somewhere here um the reason we want that no i did not take the remove consume so hold over here could go into a Woken's Rail Spike. Um, if I can draw more morsels, I could scale faster and then I could spike out. Hmm. I have a dupe, right? Yes, I have a dupe. What's the dupe consideration here? Second Glimmer. We have Diligent here. Diligent is going to make this a little more tough for us. Um, I need Wave Clear. That's one of the biggest problems we have. And Scaling. I, I guess I pick up Vine Grass first. That solves 
diligent. The hold over is solved by is put into rail spikes. I can draw two things faster. The minus one here should be put on a two cost spell. Gravel. And then the 20 consume. No. Trinket shop is a no go right now. I have a minus two here that I could utilize into something. Um, but where? I guess I don't just. I don't take it. Okay, no brace gonna die here in this run. I pick up a second glimmer. Wave clear is important here. Yeah, that's one of the biggest problems in my... Yes. Um, you don't cut cards. Can we cut units? Do we have units we can cut? No. Consume? No. I can't take any of these. Could purge, I could take a minus two, go exactly 150. Let's minus two the bone rattler. I guess the trample stone play it ASAP. Okay. This is a bit tight, but I think we can win. Okay, let's go. Whew. I made this run harder than it na had to be. Okay. Um, I like what I see here. Pull you. Sting. Animus. Morsel. You. Scale. Okay. I need to find a way to spike a good one. I need a good spike. Okay, it's always vine grass first. We play perils. We get a unit with an tumbra. We don't have the spell. One, two, three, four, five, six, eight cards in my hand. Seven. Okay, let's draw cards first. No, I can do this instead. Then the play here is to morsel. Play three morsels. I can spike for draw six. Okay, good. There's the old magic. Um... Although I don't have a very good morsel to play that into. Okay, that's one morsel. Do this bottom. We scale. I wish I could hold on to this spells, but I don't think I can. This spike is dead. <laughs> it's so hard to get value out of it. Let's burn... I guess a root seeds here. Then perils, we burn curses. Guess we can't handle the curse. Double morsel here. More. More. Play Rail Spike. Play Rattler. Okay, do we have enough survivability now? Um, the burn here is Root Seeds again. Okay, wait, wait. Let's do Gravel. 
Okay. Magma. Push up. Get extra ember. I don't want to take the curse. We spike. We rail spike. That's free. Glimmer bottom. Okay, we can get out of this. Um, let's purge. Wait. Yes. Okay, razor sharp scale here. Okay, I need to rail spike first. See what I get. Okay. I then excavator to get rid of the curses. I can get a little more. Okay, we're out of this. Conundrum. Okay. That's annoying. I think this is a clan combination or this is a unit I have not really mastered the play yet. Morsel Maid is a rare unit and I need to know how to play him out. I need to test if you can make two of these. I don't even know what happens if you do that. Maybe it should have been the alloyed construct line here. Okay, it is a long run. I'm 1 hour 27 minutes in. Ooh, I think we still secured the victory. Not happy about how we got the victory though. Okay. Yeah, one big learning, Shroud Spike is not good for this. Play bottom. Um, get rid of these. Scale. Yeah, we do get to the certain number. We just did not address the elephants in the room. Basically scaling. Oh, sorry, wave clear was the biggest problem here. Okay, we're good. We need just to do the same on the Divinity. Um, do this. Um, more so. Um, hmm. No way to get more so. I can ping out a more so. There you go. That's how you get morsels. Kill another morsel. Okay. I think we're gonna get through this. Draw more. Okay. Okay, good. I almost skipped out on vine grass as well for diligent. That would have been awful. Hitting 500 by 2. Yeah, there's still the problem of what if I did not hit trample. Okay, morsel. Kill it. Kill it for more morsels. Okay. And one final turn. Okay, one final play of morsels. And we are gonna secure our victory, finally. Whew. I think we got through this. But I need to learn. This is not something I'm very good at yet. Morsel made. 
Okay. Maybe it's not the morsel made problem. It's not addressing the missing parts of my run. Thank you, Shard of Divinity. That's going to be a lot of extra health for us. Good thing we went to 150. And here is the fight. The final fight of today's... This run's... Video. Ah, I don't know what I'm saying. Okay. Let's do this. So... Okay. More so. Venom. No. Oh, wait, wait. I can solve this. Can do this so that it gets eaten. I play Penumbra. And it were okay. Bone rattle for 45. Okay, we need to scale as much as we can. And where's my trample? Give me this unit in front. Let's scale. It's 9 damage shield on Penumbra. We need his extra hit. Where's my trample? I found it. Where's the trample? Play it. There you go. Let's glimmer this floor. It's scary. Um, what did I do? Okay, I did not play that turn well enough. Okay. Um, how do we do this turn? We're trampling, right? Yes, yes you are. Um, pull you to the front. Play. Need to play perils. Need to ping something if I can. This. Glimmer. Real spike. Need scaling. More. Not yet enough. You have 100 HP left. I have my glimmer here. Or one of the glimmers. I need morsels. Let's address the morsel problem first. Okay. I need to... What? Get rid of that. Let's draw. Thing. Two, eleven by one hundred seventy eight. Um, do I just get more morsels? Might need to replay this. Okay, am I alive? Yes, we're still alive. Okay, this is the turn where I can probably do a good spike. Do this. Push him up. Hmm. Can I spike him? That's not enough, I think. Hmm. Let's... Let's rail spike here. Okay, there you go. I get extra morsel. Which means extra healing. Okay, good. That helps. 
Okay, we get through the boss. There you go. Take some hits here and also the protector in the back takes some hits. But we do address the mini boss there, so we're good. Okay, next. Um, perils. So no more shroud spikes that I need to play very hardly. Um, wait. I need to sting. Glimmer and then rail spike. Okay, I need to remove something from this floor. How much damage do I have? 280. So I clear things through. I can put someone up. This guy. Which we maybe can... What's that? I think we can get that, right? Okay, 290. This is trample, right? Why am I not getting this guy then? Okay, that's fine. He dies to the pyre, I guess. We clear this floor. I don't even know what's happening anymore. Okay. Let's put in the morsels. What am I doing? I'm spiking myself. Okay. I want to clean this run up. I want to learn this. So I might replay this run right after this. Okay, Glimmer is here. Let's Glimmer... Bottom. I can write, I can maybe eventually Glimmer it again. Okay. Okay, I think we have secured the victory here. We are, I see the light of at the end of the tunnel. Where's my morsels? I think I should have visited some magic shops first. Okay. There you go. Just draw through stuff over and over again. Should have played the glimmer downstairs that I forgot. Okay. Ah. I thought we were gonna lose the run, guys. I really thought we were gonna lose it. But we held on. Play this to get morsels and ember. Um, play you here. Get rid of those. Okay. Okay, Penumbra dies though. Okay, we get the victory anyways. But I think I need to replay this and get more learnings out of this but let's talk through the run summary here and give you my thoughts on what went wrong Whew. we were through that okay 17 wins okay what are the problems on this run First is you don't have enough hits on the floor. So if we were hoping to trample, we wanted at least an extra hit. However, we did not find it anywhere. That's one of the major problems of this run. 
um, survivability was, I don't think, the major problem. It's really um, scaling. Um, we're not scaling fast enough to get to a level of clearing floors comfortably. Um, we did not focus on getting wave clear through Glimmer. Um, so I guess that's one of the problems with Mortal made similarly with Alloyed Construct. Um, without Trample, they have problem clearing floors. So it's one of one priority to look for something to do that for them so that they only have to handle two to three units, which is enough with their hits. Um, don't chase steel shops too much. Um, try to address the bigger elephant in the room. In this run, wave clear. Don't take Shroud Spike with Morsel Made. This gave us more problems than uh, we needed to address. This could have been a draw into another card. And maybe that extra money could have been spent elsewhere. Maybe I could have built the old magic a little differently if I did not take the Shroud Spike. And consistency. Uh, I really need to lean very hard on the morsel line here. So going to magic shops, looking for minus ones to play everything out, maybe a holdover. Um, I think one of the good things I mentioned at the start of the run was getting a gravel minus two with holdover, but we did not lean in on that. So I think that was a mistake as well. I will rerun this seed again offline and see how well I can navigate it and maybe improve the score in. Because we did take a lot of damage into Penitent, negative 50%. Fell also bodied us, negative. Yeah, there were we were taking a lot of damage throughout the run towards the mid game. So let me look into this and... I might record that, I'm not sure, maybe with no commentary and upload it as one of the reruns in this channel. So yeah, we held on to our 17 winning streak. We have three more to go. So it was a shaky run, guys. I, I do apologize. So as always, leave a like or a dislike, guys, if you enjoyed this video. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't. And as always, guys, remember... Siege today. Thank you very much for watching.